there is a big difference between feminism and promiscuity. The women we see in our music videos who are constantly naked, who are using profanities and trying to sound manly, those women are not the feminists that the women need. Candelisa Rice, Hillary Clinton are what I will call feminists. If you think what you see on BET channels, what you see women doing that makes them money is what makes them feminists, then you were raised with something missing. If we are saying we want women who are going to be known more than just for their body parts, then we cannot have women who are constantly, constantly selling or promoting their sexuality as the face of women's rights. Some of you are fans and can never be objective. But when you put these women at the forefront of fighting for women, then you are defeating the whole objective. You rather promote these women in the rap or entertainment industry, but do not put them as the face of women's rights because you will confuse the young girls who we are trying to raise to be intellectuals as opposed to people who rely on their body. We're not going to lie and say sex doesn't sell, sex sells. But if in 2021, the women who are winning the Grammys and the BETs for their profanities and promiscuity and almost pornographic imagery, if those are the women that we put as the face of women's rights, then we are defeating, defeating the whole purpose and we're undermining the women who have come before us.